In the early 2000s, China was on a mission to revolutionize its industrial landscape. But to do that, they first had to connect their cities with a web of bridges that would blow your mind. These engineering marvels defied gravity and logic, but what are the mysteries behind its construction? And what impact has it had on China's ever-changing landscape? Join us as we unravel the untold story of the Dengyang Kunshan Grand Bridge. Let's fast forward to today, where we're witnessing one of the most incredible bridge projects ever. A railroad bridge stretching a massive 100 miles connecting the bustling city of Shanghai to the vibrant town of Nanjing, Jiangsu province's capital. Wrap your head around this. The sheer size of this bridge is mind-boggling. But it's not just about the length. It's about navigating a landscape as diverse as it is challenging. Picture rivers, lakes, canals, rice paddies, and terrain that'll make your head spin. Against all odds, the masterminds behind this project have risen to the challenge, crafting designs that push the boundaries of what's possible. But here's the question. Will this bridge be the crowning achievement of Chinese engineering? Or will it just end up as another footnote in history's annals? Only time will tell, but one thing's for sure, the journey to get there promises to be nothing short of monumental. As the longest bridge on the planet, it spans over 100 miles of sheer engineering genius. But it's part of something much bigger. We're talking about the Beijing-Shanghai High-Speed Railway Project, a game-changer designed to connect the bustling metropolis of Shanghai to the capital of Jiangsu Province. And guess what? This mammoth structure, stretching an eye-popping 165 meters in length, was thrown together in just four short years. Behind every great bridge is an army of dedicated workers, and the Dengang Kunshan Grand Bridge is no exception. A massive team of 10,000 workers, from core laborers to engineers and everything in between, works tirelessly to bring this megastructure to life. Now, at first glance, the construction costs might seem high, at about $8.5 billion, but when we look closer, it's a smart investment. Compared to traditional methods, the method of construction was faster and used less land. Choosing to put the high-speed train line on a bridge was a clever move. It means we don't need as much land in the busy areas, and they could finish building quickly. Instead of needing a lot of space on the ground, the bridge only needs a small area, about 27 acres, compared to 70 acres for a regular train line. This shows that they're trying to use land smartly and sustainably. Using pre-made parts also made things easier and faster. The project started in 2008 when they made the first of over 2,000 pillars for the project. They built big parts called box girders in special factories along the route, then moved them onto the pillars using special cranes. These factories were so efficient that they could make more than two girders a day, and by May of 2009, they finished putting all the beams in place. And finally, by November 2010, they laid down all the tracks. Their hard work paid off in June of 2011, because this marvel of engineering stagged the Guinness World Record for being the longest bridge on the planet. But let's not sugarcoat it. Building the Dengang Kunshan Grand Bridge was no walk in the park. It was a mega dream project, a testament to China's ambition to overhaul its communication infrastructure, and they delivered big time. With this bridge, China catapulted itself into the future, seamlessly connecting its prominent industrial hubs and paving the way for a transportation revolution. This colossal structure defies expectations and stands as a testament to human ingenuity. Picture this. A bridge that spans across the low rice paddies of the Yaxi River Delta, daringly traversing the open waters of Yingshan Lake in Sezhui, and that's just the start. Standing proudly at 100 feet above the ground, this bridge is no ordinary feat of engineering. It's a symbol of innovation and ambition. Stretching over a staggering distance, most of its length follows the majestic Yangtze River, albeit at a distance ranging between 8 to 80 kilometers south of it. This bridge isn't just a connector though, it's a game changer for the entire region, opening up new possibilities and connecting communities like never before. And it's divided into two major sections, each with its own character and challenges. The Dengyang section spans about 52 kilometers, while the Kunshan section impressively stretches for 113 kilometers. That's over 165 kilometers of engineering brilliance seamlessly stitching together land and water. Sure, it may have given up its title as the world's largest sea-crossing bridge to the Hong Kong Zohai Maku Bridge, but make no mistake, the Dengyang Kushan Grand Bridge is still a force to be reckoned with. It's supported by a staggering array of 2,000 pillars and steel cables, each one defying gravity and connecting lands. One of its most remarkable features is its seamless integration with the surrounding environment. Ships are able to effortlessly glide beneath its towering structure thanks to its ingenious design that ensures smooth passage for vessels of all sizes. But the wonders don't stop there. 
Beyond Yangchang Lake, the bridge continues for another 5.6 miles, tracing the shimmering shores of Yingchen Lake in Suzhou. In this section, it's no ordinary bridge either. It's a marvel of steel cables, towering pillars, and a steel structure weighing a staggering 450,000 tons. With its completion, it effortlessly shattered records, cementing its status as the largest bridge on the planet. And let's not forget about its rail segment, known locally as Langfang Qingzang, stretching an astonishing 114 kilometers. The Grand Bridge is a key player in the Great Beijing-Shanghai High-Speed Railway Project. This new bridge has transformed travel times dramatically and cut the journey from Ningbo to Jingzang from a grueling four and a half hours down to just two. This is some serious progress. But the Dengying Kushan Grand Bridge isn't just a means to an end for the Chinese government. It's become a destination in its own right. Tourists from far and wide flock to marvel at its sheer size and engineering prowess. Who would have thought a bridge could be such a hotspot for sightseers? The masterminds behind this behemoth project have been in high demand after this successful project. But despite the global fame, details about the designers and engineers behind the Dengang Kushan Grand Bridge remain hidden for quite a while. Later, it was announced that the China Road and Bridge Corporation was the brains behind the operation. These folks are no strangers to epic projects, having tackled everything from railways to tunnels with finesse. Let's take a closer look at this marvel of engineering that promises more than just a simple journey from point A to B. This bridge is unique in the way that it's been built. It's a viaduct bridge designed to conquer even the most daunting landscapes. From bustling cities like Danyan, Suzhou, and Chengzhou Wuki to the serene shores of Kunxi, it spans across them all, seamlessly connecting communities and cutting through the heart of China's economic powerhouse, the Yangtze River Delta region. But what makes it stand out from bridges around the world? Well, let's put it into perspective. While the Lake Parnch Train Coffs Way in Louisiana and the Bang Nai Expressway in Thailand are impressive in their own right, with lengths of nearly 24 miles and 34 miles respectively, the Dangyang Kushan Grand Bridge dwarfs them at a staggering 102.4 miles. And trust me, when you're crossing this behemoth, you'll understand why it's more than deserving of the title Grand Bridge. But here's where it gets really interesting. This bridge isn't just about convenience, it's about pushing the boundaries of what's possible. Initially planned as a rail bridge for China's high-speed trains, it now serves as both a rail and roadway solution, thanks to some clever engineering adjustments. Now, let's talk numbers. The construction cost. A jaw-dropping 8.5 billion US dollars, translating to a mind-boggling 51 million US dollars per kilometer. This bridge isn't just built to last, it's built to withstand the worst that Mother Nature can throw at it. With a projected lifespan exceeding 100 years and the ability to withstand earthquakes, typhoons, and even collisions from vessels weighing up to 300,000 tons, it's a true testament to human resilience and innovation. So buckle up and get ready to experience the journey of a lifetime across the Dengyang Kushan Grand Bridge. If you enjoyed this content, check out another one of our videos and subscribe for more astonishing builds.